and there's a pretty sweet statue of a bearded dude here. I don't know who this is, but I'm going to call him Gramps. I'm going to say that this is Gramps, and Gramps no. used to own this shop, and now taking up the family name. So that's that's what the story is. No fucking clue. What the fuck is going on? idea what to do here. I really should have looked at the... Uh, really should have looked at the tutorial first. Well, this is kind of a cool little area back here. It's still under development. Um, okay, well, I'm probably going to edit over all of this. Alright, well, now that I've sat here for three minutes waiting for the store to close, not really knowing when it's supposed to close or how long it stays open, I finally um, decided to look at the help menu and found out that while I'm in this little one menu here, this sort of top hat menu, um, then I have to press Q to bring up the order sheet. So now I'm actually able to order things and being that I only have $44, I'm not really able to order much. So I'm wondering if I should go for up something big and hope that the one big thing sells, or if I should go for a ton of small things. And I think the better thing to do would be to go with a ton of small things. So I think what I'll do is I think I'll get two health potions and two mana potions. And I have no idea when my delivery is supposed to come in. But I'm assuming... Or do I just get that stuff? Oh, okay, now it says the order's ready in the back room, so I think I can pick that up now. So we'll click on that, and now I have health potions. Sweet. Um, alright, now before I sell it, I'm gonna look at Okay, so apparently I increased the price with the plus button, and being that we have to make a profit... I'm going to upcharge. Now, let's see if somebody pays 400%. So we'll put a health potion there, we'll put a health potion here, put a couple of mana potions in here, and look at that, now we actually have shit in our store, and look at that, people are coming in to buy our things. This is wonderful. This is more than I ever can imagine. Hey, are you gonna buy? Oh, oh, wow, he bought that super overpriced potion. This is phenomenal. What a great day. People are buying these potions for so much. This is wonderful. I'm gonna put in another order right away. Cool. This is clearly, I mean, look at it, it's spilling out of the top and it's standing straight up and down. It's clear, high quality. That is a high quality character. Istic. Of the mana potion. Obviously. Oh, you fucker. Okay, so clearly people are starting to get pissed off at my prices. But you know what? That's fine. Um, so now I have four health potions, and so I'm going to put another health potion down here, and I'm going to put another mana potion down in this corner. Wonderful. Come on, people. More of you need to come in. 
Is there a way to fast forward this or something? shelves automatically change in price. I would think that they do, but I may be wrong. I think the K means closing. Ooh, got some dirt on the floor. Let's just clean that up. Sorry, sorry. I didn't mean to have such a dirty floor when you... Oh my god, you fucker. Oh my god. Well, I have to keep sleeping anyways. Such dirty fucking... Fucking take off your shoes before you come in. Oh my god, fuck you. Okay, fuck you. Oh, did he just- he just stole my- Oh! Alright, well his skeleton is mine now, and so I'm gonna take this- Welcome back to- oh. Oh, cool! So the fucking name is up there, and I just need to get a little emblem. But, you know what, for now that's alright. I'm just gonna bring, uh, I don't remember what this guy's name was, but- uh, we're just gonna call him Thief. Put that in there. And if you look, we got a little bit of bone. Oh, when the fuck the shop closes? It's getting pretty dark out right now, I'd say. Alright. I don't even remember what your name is already. Do people. I wonder. If... Oh. Look at your hat. Okay. Daniel Romero's. <laughs> oh my god. Like a good person. Oh my god. Wonderful. People are buying my things. Finally. You're not thinking about stealing anything, are you? Are you? Oh, fuck you. Oh, you can eat a big old bag of blah. What you coming to look at? Mana potion. Buy it. You know you want it. Nice. All right, we're making some money now. We're running out of mana potions. Holy shit! This is phenomenal. All right, if this guy comes in looking for a mana potion, I'm gonna see. Holy shit! Okay, I have two people in here. I need to order mana potions stat. He did not. He didn't pay for. Oh my god. Alright, and that is the end of the first day, and I have an order coming in. I believe. Alright, that'll be coming in really soon. And I had a pretty profitable first day. I mean, considering I started out with 60 gold. And you know what? Being that we don't have a very large supply, I think I'm actually going to go ahead and raise prices back up to 320. Just because I'm a cheapskate. Alright, and I don't. Okay, so now I can just press E to open it whenever. Um, so this will be day two. Um, so I'm pretty sure I can also send... Okay, I don't have enough money, but I'm pretty sure I can send this guy out to adventure and he can go get things for me. So let's hope for that in the future. In the meantime... My store clean. Aha, dirt. <laughs> I just realized there's an arrow in my knee. That is... So, okay, so the perspective of this game, and the thing that I find really unique about it overall, um, it's just a really unique concept because, um, you're, instead of playing as the adventurer in an RPG, or the hero, um, sort of in this, like, sort of in this, like, um, t -t -t today, Junior. Fantasy world. You are now instead playing the shopkeep. Um, 
which is, I mean, as you guys know, that's like obviously the opposite of what you'd normally play. And so I just find that really interesting. So like, instead of being the guy that goes out and does all the cool things, you get to be the guy in the shop that everybody stops in and buys things from before they die. A cruel, horrible, fiery death from dragons and other things. But all that aside, um, it's just a really unique concept. And um, that's what I like most about it. I also just really like kind of playing games where it's a challenge um, based on monetary value and making profit, and so I find that intriguing about it as well, but I, yeah, just overall I really like this game. Um, dead fuckers with their fucking dirty feet. Every goddamn day, just fucking, oh, take your shoes off at the door. Are you saying something to me? Did you just fucking say to me? I don't know. Maybe that's talking to me. Stop trying. It's not going to work. Yeah, I don't know what's not going to work, but whatever. It's not my business. Um, as it is my business, but um, never mind. It's not funny. Oh, ho, ho, 320% and people don't care. They're still buying, it looks like. So this is wonderful. You um, can't do that. I keep pressing spacebar and it tells me that I can't do things and I just want to do whatever it is that I can't. Oh, hello there, buddy. What you gonna do? What you looking? We got a health potion? Oh, you fuck. Oh, my God. Bring him down to 300% because I'm a good guy. 300% <laughs> profit. This... I, I didn't even go out and get this. I didn't do anything to make it. I bought this. I bought this for 10 gold. No, 12 gold. Sorry, excuse me. I'm selling it for 36. I'm selling it for three times the amount. This, my friends, this, my friends, is why I don't have any money. But I'm not getting the business that I'd like to be getting. I'm wondering if it's because I'm new or if it's because I don't have a lot of variety in here. I know what it really is though, and I knew it the whole time. Really what I need is like, I need like one of those signs. They like twirl around and you flip all around and you stand outside and you're like, fucking hot dogs, get your hot dogs right over here. I'm dressed up as a giant fucking wiener. Or maybe that's not what I'm missing. Maybe, maybe I'm just in social work. Oh yeah, but anyways, back to the arrow in my knee. That's hilarious. That's the, you know, the Skyrim reference to, um, I used to be an adventurer like you, but I got an arrow to the knee. Um, which is kind of funny, so that kind of, um, that kind of gives off the impression that I at one point was one of these adventurers, and then I got an arrow to the knee, and so then I came home and pursued Grandpappy's dreams of becoming a shopkeeper. Oh, from back there, it looks like Grandpappy had one eye. It looks, it looks like Cyclops. And Dad, uh, what's wrong with you? Did I just sell something again? This is phenomenal. Keep buying shit. Oh, we're getting a rush of people. Oh, we're getting a rush of people. Okay, okay. Um, I need more. bought these things, right? I think one of them bought things, and I think the other one just left because they're outraged about the prices. I'm going to drop the prices again. Um, so, we're actually going to go ahead and bring it down. Okay. Okay, so now they're only at... Oh my god, fuck off. Yeah, I have something to fucking say to me. You wanna fucking go, bud? I fucking go. I fucking get you at the broom. Sweep you at your fit. Can't fucking do it. Can't sweep outside my store. That's probably a good thing. All this fucking rock would ruin my nice broom, anyways. Oh no! I get it. So, like, I keep pressing spade fire because I want to jump, and it finally told me jumping isn't gonna happen. Jumping is for jokers. So, basically, there's no jump function in the game, which is really fucking stupid. And I really wish I could jump just because it really helps to pass it. Oh my god, are you fucking kidding me? 
I can't believe this. People are being complete assholes. I can't fucking stand it. Almost two full shelves. Come on, Homer Lane. Oh, what a great, what a great regular. You come on back now tomorrow, Homer. You hear? Oh, who the fuck are you, bud? Oh, this is Homer as well. Not related though, obviously. Two different last names. Or it's just everybody named Homer. No, that's Hugh. That's Hugh Jackman. Well, I really don't care. Hugh Jackman just just fucking didn't like my prices and left. Oh my god. I feel like a worthless piece of shit. <laughs> um, fuck. People are really fucking my shit up right now and I don't like it. Making sure nobody steals any- Oh you fucker. Uh oh. I just killed an innocent. Um, I, sorry, um, I don't know what that, oh my god, are you serious? Is it because I wasn't in my store? This is alright, we're getting bones. That's what we need. Bones. Thank you! Oh my god, what happened to that skeleton? Who are you? You don't have a name! Oh, you do. It's, it's, it's Dick Jackman. Hugh Jackman's lesser known piece of shit brother. Oh. Uh, <laughs> you want to buy? I'm trying to buy something from me. People are just ungrateful. I'm like the only shop in the area. Oh my god. It's fine. It's fine. I already made enough profit for today. 570 gold, everybody. It's probably more than you carry with you at any oh, given point. You, you know what? Fuck you. Next person that comes in here and does that, I'm gonna fucking kill. And actually, I think we're going to stop this one here. So, thank you all for watching, and I hope you guys come back to watch the next one. I'm hoping to do quite a few episodes in this, um, hopefully do...